Hey guys, it's me, Abby. Today I'm going to be doing a 11... Eleven life hacks. Some of them are potatoes like they're girls, some of them are like boys and girls and some of them. Yeah, none of them are specifically for boys. I've never honestly looked that up, so yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video. Actually I've already made the video and it was twenty minutes long and I was like, whoa, no thank you. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh first life hack. The first life hack is if you have a power outage or your light bill is too high, um, I don't know, and you do not have a candle, use a crayon, and yeah. Hack number two is to, um, like, Yes, to pistachios. I'm obsessed with pistachios. When you, if you have a child or if you have kids or anything, when they're born, get them a email address. Like, well, let me put it this way: as soon as you realize you're pregnant, or if you are a boy watching this, as soon as your wife or girlfriend or whatever is pregnant get them an email address like an email like a gmail something like that and some pictures memories text letters things like that to it and then when they graduate or for their 16th birthday or when they move out of the house or when they get married, anything of that, I would prefer, I would like actually do it when they get married personally because it'd be like their marriage gift or like the one that I have been waiting for. But if they never get married, then obviously to them before and it's just like something really sweet and I highly recommend that. The next hack is to, on a night that you don't have school, like maybe during Christmas break or summer break is what I would do it in, but, uh, or Thanksgiving, this would be a good one for a Thanksgiving night, or when you're making s'more, or just like a random night that you don't have school, I wouldn't recommend doing this on a school night, but get some water bottles that like you drink out of and then refill it back up with like spigot water it doesn't necessarily have to be spigot water but yeah make sure they have like a cap to them that won't spill and then put glow either put the glow stick in it or break up the glow stick and put the liquid in there and you have glow in the dark bowling Another hack is to use a man's razor because it's much softer because it's meant for their face and also put in deodorant at night because your deodorant needs time to soak in and it will not put as much stain so that just kind of goes with that I guess. Uh, okay the next hack is to fill your water bottle up halfway. Okay so say it's halfway and then put it on its side. I don't know if you can tell, but like put it on its side on the freezer in the morning. Fill it up with water until you get a full bottle. And then you'll have freezing cold water because the other half of the water is going to melt it. And depending on what drink you're doing, it and depending on what you want to freeze, if you're doing a fruit punch, you want to do the frozen part fruit punch also. And the next hack, I'm trying to make this real quick, is to use your phone, put your phone in a cup and use it as a speaker. The 
The next one is kind of, oh, sorry, the same thing, but it is to put your phone in a paper towel, like, put, like, slit it and then stick the speaker in the paper towel, and then use something to hold it up, and yeah, such as cups. The next hack is to, like, instead of just doing this, say, oh, it's time to hit my nails, roll up your nail polish like this to warm it up so you don't get any air bubbles. The next one is to, if your friend says something behind your back or says something, be the bigger person and eat. don't ignore them. That's why tip. don't ignore them. Make, make them understand that it doesn't feel feel that good to get talked behind their back. I'm not saying going talk behind their back. I'm just saying explain it to them. And the next heck almost last is to use a clip to keep all of your hair ties together. The last heck is if your teacher doesn't allow you to chew gum which I don't think many people really use up is to use Tic Tacs or any type of breath mints. But if you're not allowed to use breath mints, you can still do it, but just kind of have a hand sanitizer that sort of kind of smells like it. Obviously, this won't smell like this, but I have one in my purse, in my bag, or in my bag, so it smells like it. And if they ask what the smell is, just say, oh, it's my hand sanitizer, and... So I hope you enjoyed this video and I know it was kind of long, but I will see you next time and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and comment down below if you have any video ideas or if you subscribed or anything like that.